The Master Sword in Tears of the Kingdom hides its base damage value, but luckily for us, it's also not very good at hiding it. First things first, to check the base value, we can simply look at the arrow that compares a dropped weapon. Conveniently, I have an 8-fold long blade with 30 attack. Why is that convenient? Well, that's exactly the same as the Master Sword. But the Master Sword actually has two power-up states, both of which aren't added to the base damage value. However, now that we know its base value, we can simply check health bars. For the powered up state in the depths, we can see that one hit deals 1.5 times as much damage. So the base power becomes 45 when fighting enemies in the depths. Finally, when fighting Ganons, the Master Sword powers up to its maximum potential, which we can see as double that of the weapon with a power of 30. Do you think the Master Sword holds up in this game?